Oh, hello. Welcome back to another episode of the Disney Princess Legacy Challenge. Oh, sounds like Sven's got something to say. All right, Sven, pipe down. Okay, so I can't actually remember. It's been a little while. I've left it a while since I last recorded this series. Uh, we just got married. Did Have they already tried for a baby? Yes. Okay, let's find out if Anna's pregnant then, shall we? All right, Anna, what are we working with? Oh, she's pregnant. Okay, good. Fantastic news. Well, you know what? In that case, I think we should celebrate. Let's go on a little family day out. Maybe we'll go to the, the park or something. Shall we? Go for a little picnic or something in the snow? We definitely won't be inviting hands. Who should we invite? Elsa and the animals. That's all we need. Let's go to the park. Here we are. Oh, hey, Elsa. Maybe, maybe go give her a cuddle or something. Or gush about uh, Crystal. Oh, they're a bit cold. I'll dress them in their uh, their cold weather outfits that are so much more different to their normal outfits. See, completely different. Outdoor outfits got a hat. Right, Kristoff, I think you need to go and uh, grill some grill some hamburgers. Also, where the fuck's Olaf? Where is he? He just kind of blends in. Oh, there he is. There's uh, Christoph's grave look, remember? Yeah. Memories. Should we build another snowman? Let's build one with Elsa. Hans, congratulations on ge getting married to Christoph. I hope you two are very happy together. Oh, Hans. Don't be jelly. Psycho ex-boyfriend. Oh, look at Anna's little, little baby bump. It's looking pretty nice there, ladies. Christoph, how are you getting on with those burgers? Oh, you finished. Okay, we, I mean, you could have called us over or something. Oh, the snow pal's done. How creative. Well, let's just all have a nice little burger. Family fun time. Oh, look at Sven in the background. He looks like he's having a great time. Let me just take a look at that burger. Oh, it looks greasy as fuck. If anything, it looks a bit mouldy. And Elsa somehow got two. I feel like Anna is the type who's going to give Kristoff a really hard time now that she's pregnant. She's just constantly going to be like, Oh, baby wants a burger. Baby wants McDonald's. Because, <laughs> of course, Arendelle famously known for their McDonald's franchise. What are you saying you don't like the cold? You're all about the cold. You're literally like Mrs. Cold. I don't think she's even told him the good news yet, has she? Share big news, there we go. And then share big news to Elsa as well. Just get it all out, no family secrets here. See the look on Kristoff's face. Lovingly looking into each other's eyes. This poor bloke, he's got no idea what's coming to him. Yeah, good idea, Kristoff. I think you probably should sit down. <laughs> I love the instant reaction, which is just like the lip quibble. Like, what? What do you mean? Oh, but he's got a big buff now from receiving big news. Okay, now you should probably tell your sister, I think. Yeah? Good. <laughs> the instant sad face gets me every time. Alright, well that's enough family fun. I'm thinking... Let's have a uh, a baby shower. I'm going to put Anna into like, I don't know, second trimester or something. Yeah, there we go. Second trimester. And now she can throw a baby shower. Visit gynecologist. Plan social event. Pipe it down, Olaf. Give it a rest. Okay, so we're going to do baby shower. Hosted by Anna. We have Kristoff, Elsa, should probably invite our parents, maybe Tiana as well, and Freddy, even though Freddy used to bully Elsa. Uh, we'll get a caterer. Don't really need anything else. Uh, mixologist, yeah, I mean, just because Prego can't drink doesn't mean the rest of us can't. And then, I want to do it at the castle. Frozen castle, there we go. Yeah, perfect. Oh, Aurora's got her pretty dress on. Okay, so... Go and tell your mother the big news. Wait, why isn't there an option to share big news? 
invite to feel baby. I mean, you could do that. Do that at least. Share big news. Okay, well, I can't share the big news with Aurora, but I guess she already knows. Maybe it's mother's intuition. Yeah, that's right. Waddle over. Aww. Hands just disappear right in there. I think you got a little bit too close there, Aurora. But that's okay. That's all right. Okay, where's the party actually happening? Is everyone going to the same spot? Oh, no, everyone's just going to the bar. <laughs> right, that makes sense. Invite to feel baby. What about this guy? No, he's not part of the family. I think I made a mistake having having this party at such a big lot because I'm losing track of everybody. Okay, so that, there's Kristoff. What about everyone else? Anyone on this floor? No. Okay, okay. Top floor? Yes, few people on the top floor. Of course, of course, follow the alcohol. Oh, they're watching doggy TV. You're looking very smart, Freddy. It's nice to know you made an effort. What are they? Are they cousins? I think so. Or m no, actually, I think maybe he's an uncle. Yeah, he's an uncle. Oh, what's this we got here? A little, little sweet and spicy. Salty llama. And another sweet and spicy. What good is a baby shower without very strong spirits? Okay, we've achieved getting everyone to feel the baby. That's good, that's good. What about uh, dancing? Any music going on around here? Or How come you can't do it with the TV? Why do you need to have a stereo to listen to music? This is 2020. I mean, Christ. Christ alive. Especially when it just so happens that Elsa doesn't seem to have a single radio in her house. Or stereo, even. Oh, shit. Maybe this wasn't the best location after all. Well, it would have been if I had just put, like, a radio and some presents in Anna's inventory. Then we wouldn't be in this mess. I mean, we're in silver, so there's that. Tell funny story. And then tell your mum a funny story. <laughs> Watch Lost Dog's journey home with Aurora. So deep. He's literally just like completely ignoring her. This is <laughs> this is really sad. This is Anna's party and your own dad is completely like blanking you. Um You you alright there, Elsa? You alright? You look a little bit little bit miserable. You jealous. You jelly. What's wrong? Oh okay. I'll just, I'll give you a minute. Well, guys, I'm having a great time. I don't know about you. Juice on the rocks. A wrench. I hope you're not drinking, Prego. I wonder if there's a way to change the channel to music. Probably not, huh? No. Oh, well. Worth a try. Can't really judge. If I was having a baby shower, I'd probably insist that there was a bar. Well, this was a nice family gathering. Elsa, I'm not being funny, but you need to cheer the fuck up. You're bringing everyone down. We're at your house. You are the hostess with the grossest. Just having a chat with our dad and... Oh, we got a silver medal, having a nice chat with our dad and... All right, all right, we've all had fun. Okay, we've all had a few drinks. Let's go home. Come on, everyone. Let's go home. Okay, do we have a little baby crib anywhere? I don't think so. I think I got rid of it. That's all right. We can just buy a new one. Here we go. Just pop the baby next to the fire. Keep it warm. That's what they did in the olden days. They just put the babies next to the fire, keep them warm. Oh, and we've got a few gifts as well. Little thing there. Little unicorn. Oh, yeah, okay, we'll take the unicorn. Um, not really fussed about any of the other stuff, so won't really bother with that. Okay, let's see if we can have this babe. Just stick her in labour. There we go. What? Go and have the baby. Kristoff, get in here! Get in here and watch. We have to stand here and go through this incredible pain. You can at least watch it. Oh, we had a baby girl. Rapunzel. Just the one? Aww. 
Oh, you made it just in time. Typical. Yeah. Come in after the fact. Act like you didn't do it on purpose. Oh, did I miss the pain? I'm screaming. Honestly, what a fucker. Just age that baby up. Age it right up. Oh, here it comes. Rapunzel aged up. Okay, what's a... Uh, inquisitive. I think that would describe Rapunzel. Right, let's take a look at her. Let's uh, give her a little bit of a Rapunzel makeover. All right, Specky, lose the specs. She does look quite similar. I think Rapunzel's got more like golden hair, doesn't she? I mean, that hair's quite, quite Rapunzel-y, isn't it? Oh, so is that one. Maybe we'll go for that hair. And she wears like a pinkish purple dress. I mean, I think that'll do for every day. Outerwear, working backwards. Hot weather, swimwear doesn't really matter. Oh no, can't put her in that. She can, she can have that one for swimwear. Party time, stick her in that, fuck it. Wear that one for bedtime. Formal wear, oh that's pretty cute, formal wear as it is to be honest. Oh that one's quite close to her dress, we'll do that one. Yeah, little, little shoesies to match, okay. Beautiful, beautiful. Job done. Oh, Sven came in. Hey Sven, oh and he left, okay. Just wanted to take a look and <laughs> he got bored pretty quick of that. Aww. Are we gonna play with the dollhouse? Well, we can get rid of this crib now, I don't really need it. The baby's warm enough. You know what I think would be a good idea? Rapunzel's quite a, an inquisitive child. I mean, as you saw, you saw the trait. And uh, I think maybe she's gonna run away from home, take herself on a little walk. I mean, she doesn't know what she's doing, she's a fucking toddler, but... I feel like she's just so fascinated with the outside world that she's gonna... She's gonna take a little walk in the woods, maybe. That sounds really creepy, but we're gonna go with it. Rapunzel, what are you doing here in the forest all by yourself? Going for a walk? Your parents are gonna be awfully worried about you and where you've gone. You don't care, do you? Nah, she shouldn't give a shit. Just taking herself for a walk to the forest so she can just go and wreck that joint. Oh, but hang on a minute. Who the fuck is this crazy bitch? She doesn't really seem like the most stable person but you know she's taken herself for a walk in the park at six o'clock in the morning i'm sure she she must be all right she, she must be good wrong this here is mother gothel a notoriously bad egg she goes to the park she likes to steal little kids and raise them as her own so she can steal their magic powers and uh rapunzel was just at the wrong place at the wrong time so she's going to go ahead and add rapunzel to her family just like that simple as and then we're going to take Rapunzel to our new home. Never to be seen again by her parents. Sorry, Rapunzel. Off we go. There we go. We have a new parent now. Funny how that happens, isn't it? Okay, so... Welcome. I'll uh, let you just give yourself a look around. But this is your home. It's, uh, don't be deceived. It's uh, pretty spacious. Plenty of room for you. This is our little life tower. You're going to live up here at, at the very top. Um, any questions or concerns or no? Okay, great. Well, in that case, I'll just pick you up just like that. And then we'll just go and put you in your new room, which is right here. There we go. Put Rapunzel down there. It's a nice room. Oh, this is going to be a problem, the zooming in and out. Got your own bathroom, well, your own toilet, plus a sink. That's basically a bathroom. Given your little easel, got a bookcase. Then on the flip side, you've got a nice big girl bed here. So, basically everything you could possibly want. Here we go, here she comes. Pretty sinister, this story, isn't it? Yeah. Well, that's The Sims for you. This is going to really get on my nerves every time I try and zoom. Oh, no you don't. No, no, but I want to. I want to zoom. Oh, no you don't. No you don't. <laughs> Fuck it. Oh, look. That looks like Sven. It looks like Sven's come, come out to look for her. You're not going to find her. You're not going to find her. 
Well, with that, I think I'm going to end this uh, this episode here. So I will. Oh, I can zoom in. That's good. Yeah, it's been pretty eventful. In case you can't tell, we've made the transition out of Frozen into Rapunzel now. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Thank <laughs> you.